I hit that button and then I just wait awkwardly. I stare. I really should have put makeup on. Hi, my dears. It is so good to see you. I'm sorry that I was not on last night and I'm glad that I'm getting to jump on here with you today. Oh, honey, that I seriously looks so tired. Um, can I get, is anyone a makeup artist? Hey, watch this. You guys want to see me take 10 years off my face? Watch. Here we go. Okay. I know. So childish. Anyway. Oh, there's Corey. Thank you, Cora. I love you. Cora's like, Ange, get your butt on. Um, we had uh, uh, Stampin' Up! has their onstage convention going on right now. Very <laughs> pretty lady. Oh, you guys. Oh, it's so good to see you all. Um, and so I, I uh, body is done, but today I just kind of got, got to watch stuff today, and it was amazing. Oh, thank you so much. Hey. But the point, okay, so people are saying congratulations, and it's because Stampin' Up! with our annual kind of onstage convention, we had our rewards and recognition ceremony last night. And I always get such a kick out of people saying, you know, congratulations, because I think the part that actually has to come first before congratulations is me saying thank you. Um, there's no congratulations if it's not for you. So it's kind of, it's, it's a, you guys, it's not actually about me. It's about you. Because um, it's you show up for my Facebook Lives, and you order my card kits and you attend my clubs and you join my amazing West Coast Creators family and none of this happens if you're not there. So thank you and congratulations to you because we did it guys. Anyway, it was very exciting. Um, okay, so should we do a paper pumpkin alternative? This is what we were supposed to do last night. So we're going to play with that a little bit and do you want to see like a, do you want to see a sneak peek of a card I made today that's using some new stuff? Um, and I'll show it to you because I'm actually basing my kind of my card on it tonight. You guys are so cute. Okay, you ready? Should we do this? You're gonna see. Oh, you'll actually look at this. What do you notice on my messy grid paper? Because I tonight it was called. Do I have time to write this out or do I just get online? And I decided I was just getting online and not working and not worrying about it. Trisha, you're so cute. Thank you. Um. Anyway, so. You can see, look at, do you see some new stamps on there? Some new pretty sentiments. I'm, I'm a huge fan of mixed fonts where we've got like a script and then like kind of more typed. So anyway, uh, you guys are so sweet, but seriously, as I said to you, it's actually more about you than it is about me because that part, that success doesn't happen when you don't have anyone who's there. I uh, know, Alicia's like, new stamp set. Okay, yes, it is from our swag bag. So check out this card. So if you were watching on stage today, you would have seen her, uh, I can't remember her name right now, do this amazing presentation on this stamp set. And while she was talking about it and stamping, I just made one of my own. And I was like, oh, I like this, kind of fun. But I'm not gonna lie, when she was reading the names of all the different flowers at the start, um, oh yeah, broke for sure. Jean, we're toast, your visa's gonna cry. Um, <laughs> One of the names of one of the things I texted Corey. Corey, I can't say it out loud because I'm on here. So Corey, can you tell them what I thought that she was saying? And Corey thought she heard the same thing. So I don't feel bad. Anyway, so yes, this was one of the cards. And it was just kind of based on hers and what she was doing. And then I started playing and adding my own stuff. Melody Hyde. Yes, she was awesome. Yes, I'm saying Corey's like, bah, because... When she said it, it was bad. Anyway, it, it was so funny. We totally thought she was saying something bad. Anyway, okay, so yes, that's what this card is kind of going to be based on. And more of like the sketch. Well, Kristen, I seriously, I listen better. Reminds with pit. Yes, it starts with bat. And then the second part um, mm, <laughs> rhymes with pit. So bat rhymes with pit. And we thought that's what she was calling one of the, the flowers or the things that was in it. I'm like, whoa. Anyway, okay. The other lady did have a very strong, you thought she said it too? Oh, Roz, oh my God, Roz, you just made my night. Cause I was like, to Corey and I just have really dirty minds. Cause I was like, is that what she just said? And I text Corey, she's like, ah, I thought she said it too. Okay, I have to focus. I'm so bad tonight. Okay. Um, hi, James. So what I've done is I've taken one of our um, card bases. Oh, and the finger. Yes, I'm not bleeding anywhere. But as you can see, it's crazy glued together. My husband has crazy glued my finger so that I don't have to wear a band-aid. <laughs> Isn't that horrible? Um, 
Oh, Kristen, thank you. You guys are so cute. Oh, I know, Gwen. We're so classy, aren't we? Anyway, so there's my gorgeous card base. So then I was like, okay, what can I pull in that's can I can kind of start to put pieces together to make this have that similar layout? Because I was loving the layout. I, well, no, Cora, it's all good. But this is when, you know, when you teach your children, don't use a knife to open things, use the scissors. Well, <laughs> don't use a knife to open things. Use the scissors because I stabbed myself. It was awesome. Super classy. Anyway. Okay. So I have got, I'm going to go with a little bit of, um, early espresso. I've got that piece there that we already had in it with the stitching. I'm going to pull the flower, I think kind of in as like a focal point. I think I'm going to put, look at this card. It's just going together with pieces. Um, we're going to put the piece maybe in there piece, and then I'll pull it up a little bit. And then I'm thinking we'll add the on earth and maybe a few little, uh, Zhizhi sparkles and away we go. What up, Viper? Thanks, James. But James, it's because of all of you guys. It's not because of me. Okay, so let's pull this out. Now, when she was doing this, and I loved this, she kind of just pulled some random stamp from the stamp set and she said, hey, I'm going to do like a little peekaboo for kind of interest. And I'm like, hmm, that works for me. I like the peekaboo for interest. So I think that I'm just going to go with and they're not cherries. I know they're not cherries. They're berries. Hi, Anne-Marie. Oh, Mary, me too. It was a good one today. So we're going to slap that on there. Doot, doot, doot. And then we're going to grab early espresso. Oh, I can actually feel the stress leaving my body. I said to my husband, today was probably one of the best days I've had in a long time. I can't remember feeling that much energy and uplift as I did today, but it was just kind of based on like what, I don't know, I was stamping and laughing at stamping presentations and texting with, you know, friends who were watching the same thing and we were giggling together. It felt human today. And I don't know, I feel like that's not a feeling we've had a ton of. So if you can't see, check it out. See that? We've just kind of gone down the side because we don't have a ton of it peeking out, but I'm just going to give it a little bit of texture. Now, I don't want to emboss. And my only reason for not wanting to emboss is because I've already got an embossed layer there. So I feel like it might be a bit of overkill. Whoa, I'm going cross-eyed. Okay, just a sec. I totally can't see. We did have some fun times though today. So Stampin' Up! is doing an unreal job of putting on their first like it's like a truly virtual event and they're blowing it out of the water and they somehow are still making you feel special and loved. And it was Trisha. Don't you agree? It's not the same virtually, but still. Yes, absolutely. I had a small in-person. Okay. So every, <laughs> I'm never going to get to see people again, the rate we're going here where I live, all hell's breaking loose here. Oh, uh, ladies, hi, except at school because school's fine. Right? Go figure. Anyway, I was a good day. Love on stage, had a lovely long chat with Ontario. Your heart is happy. Now more stamping. Yeah, there, of course. Okay, so you guys need to decide. We might need to trim this down a bit and add a mat to it, but see what you think. Okay, so we've got our little cute little dots. Now, they don't show great with my garbage. I feel like my lighting sucks. Anyway, you realize that when you watch people stamp it on stage, I'm like, oh, you have way better lighting than I do. But I know, it's life, and I don't have a fancy schmancy. Okay, so I'm thinking here, I want it to hang off. Thank God for on stage. Oh, I, uh, Kathleen, I can't even imagine. Wait, school is fun. No, I'm being sarcastic. School, all hell's breaking loose everywhere, but school, you just go to school like normal. And But there's hand sanitizer in my room. Anyway, I'm laughing. I'm laughing, people. Did your number get called? I did. My number got called. I got, I can't remember the name of the stamp set. What, what stamp set did I get? Corey, <laughs> one that I said. I'm like, I just ordered it. But <laughs> that's okay. That means more prizes for my peeps. Okay. I got to order today. Um, what are the rough measurements on the smaller pieces? Okay. So what I have done, love, is this one is, I want to say it was just a sec, Mare. Good question. So Mare, I did a three and five eighths inch square for this uh, early espresso piece. Okay. And then this little darling is three inches by four and an eighth. So, you know, ish. So just go ish. It's a surprise. No, mine wasn't a surprise. I didn't get the surprise one. 
I think Jill got the surprise one. Hand sanitizer, it totally is a force field. Masks, why? We, why would one wear masks? We have hand sanitizer. And we were not laughing, it's actually really dangerous, but one of the little girls who's in grade one, um, the teacher caught her, she went over to the hand sanitizer thing and went, a squirt into her hand and went, and he's like, stop! Anyway, yes, super lovely. I was, why was I dying to go back to work? I'm exhausted. Yeah, well, I, I'm not going to lie. I was laughing at you when you kept saying that, Laurel. I was like, really? She's dying to go back to work? Because I feel like we might just be dying. I was number five. Trisha, what were you? I'm good at the ish. I know. We've got the ishes down. Okay, so this one, all I'm going to do is I'm going to slap four on it. Is that what it's called? Yes, I think I got Garden Wishes. That's the one that kind of went, it was part of the Dragonfly Bundle, right? Kristen's totally with it. I'm so not with it. All I cared about today was like texting the friends going, ah, did you see that? Oh, did you see that? And laughing and then posting pictures of us doing stupid things during breaks while I was like, hey guys, look, I'm sneaking in drying my hair. It was one of those. I showered for the first break. Okay, so we've got that. Okay, now I'm, I think we could pop it up. <laughs> Heck, what do we care about Canada Post? Pickled. What's pickled? Oh no, who got pickled? You got pickled? Doesn't that mean drunk? I feel like it does. I'm not pickled. So lucky. Got garden wishes. I know it is quite pretty. You're number two also. Oh, so Judy, you got... Look at... I'm like, Judy, you got the surprise. Mary Spicer, we were both number fives. <laughs> okay, I'm taking off backings. But I'm trying not to do it with the finger that hurts. <laughs> Lisa Brigger. Oh my God, I have one on my downline who seriously might take you out in order to get that one. Lisa Brigger, I miss you. Can we please be back in Las Vegas doing stupid things upside down to get photos? Like I'm, oh, I was looking at pictures of that today. And when they announced that uh, that next on state will, will be in Las Vegas, and I was like, huh, I don't even care if there's school, but I'm going because I need a repeat of that trip. That trip, I don't think my stomach has, I've never, I think I lost weight from laughing. I got abs. Okay. I was numbers. Oh, pickled by the hand sanitizer. Oh, yes. Oh, Aim, I'm sorry. Oh, Lisa Brigger says sausages. Oh, you guys. I, I feel like Lisa Brigger may need to post a photo. Vegas, baby. Are we all going? I keep waiting to see you go live so I could give you a congrats, Marcy. Oh, thank you, honey. But we were saying it, it was a group effort. It's all of you guys who did it. And I know some of you in the States are like, what do you mean? I just watch your videos. I don't order from you. It doesn't matter. You watch my videos and you share them and all of that plays into it, right? Like that's how you gain kind of exposure and find new people. And okay. Oh, I like how this is coming together. It's kind of cute. Um, so those of you who did my paper pumpkin alternatives class, I hope you enjoyed it. I'm so tired. I was six. Heart set. Ooh, it's cute. You guys are so cute. Okay, so we've got that. Now, I have to put adhesive on this. Honestly, do we even care if we make a card tonight or can we just hang out? Okay, so, oh, I don't want that. Where's my seal? There it is. Um, it extends your reach. Yes, exactly, Ash. So, Ashley, okay, I will never forget meeting Ashley. We were, were we in, like, Regina? Where were we? We were somewhere in Canada. But I, it wasn't anywhere exciting. It was like... <laughs> Ah, uh, we were prairies, weren't we? Where were we when we met? I will never forget meeting you and hugging that day. And you said something to me about, oh, and I was like, what do you mean? You said something about me not knowing who you were. And I was laughing, going, what? Like, dude, you're Ashley Pfeiffer. <laughs> okay. Um, Red Deer, that was it. Don't you love that? I can't remember where I've been. Natasha. Oh, hi, Natasha. Okay, so I'm putting down my piece. <laughs> Put down your piece. Okay, piece. So, da. There's going to be a bow somewhere in here. I can feel it. Um, now, we need to do on earth. So we need to find stamps. Or should I do peace to you and yours? I feel like I could send that out to some of my friends right now. Let's do, let's do peace to the world. Can I do that? doesn't make sense. Let's, we're going to have to do sending peace. <laughs> sending a peace. Sending a piece of chocolate. Okay. Wishing you peace and joy that's what i'd like wishing you peace to the world can we somebody come up with a funny phrase i'm close enough to vegas to crash if you don't have a title trish do it i have to restock my sympathy cards for me and my oh i had to 
<laughs> I'm just on Netflix. What are you watching? My dog Gidget just turned your notification and gave me, oh, I'm sorry, but Gidget is so stinking cute. She cracks me up. Okay, peace. Are we going to send peace? Peace to the world. I feel like that sounds wrong. Peace to you and yours. Maybe we'll do that. Okay. Peace to you and yours. Color, what do we want? Should we do a little just jade? We could. I was trying to figure out how to tie in. But sorry, that's um, that's not the right color ribbon. Is that shaded? Yeah, that's not going to work. I don't like that anyway. Is it just squeak? I haven't seen that. Uh, and it's to you. If you weren't you, then we wouldn't be watching you. I love you. You're cute. No, but I wouldn't be me if I didn't have you to interact with. So I win. Okay. Focus. Um, I don't really, I don't want to do white. I feel like white's just going to meh. So I think I'm going to do soft sea foam. We're going to soft sea foam it if I can find my scraps. And I don't know why I just developed an accent. Okay, there it is. We got some soft sea foam. Toss it. Oh, the Queen's Gambit. Oh my gosh, Natasha, I just finished watching it. I loved it. Like it was, oh my gosh. And I turned it on just kind of like fluky. And I was like, oh, what's this? And then was so in love with it. Peace, can I use that? Well, we'll just do a little strip. We'll see what it looks like, okay? Um, I think that I will use early espresso. I don't want to get too crazy color-wise. I still have the Tina Turner song in my head. Oh, uh, well, I'm sorry, but Stampin' Up! today, you guys, if, you, if you're if you not a demonstrator, if you're just, a, you know, if you're a customer or whatever, well, they created this playlist today that was on during the breaks. I was busting it in my house. Like, seriously, it felt so good. I was dancing like I was... 18 and in the bars again. 18's not legal in the bars, but that's when I started going. And it wasn't to drink. I just like to dance. So, yes. Everyone stop what they're doing and go watch Shit's Creek. Hey, 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 hey. Corey's getting people out of here. Don't listen to Corey. I'm not going to watch Shit's Creek. You're mean. <laughs> After Hedge's live. Yeah, nice save, girl. Okay. To you and yours. We've got it. Let's get this. Look at Laura's like, now? Right in the middle of it? Don't you think it's rude? Or shouldn't we at least not tell her that we're doing it? It's like telling the teacher you're going to stop listening to her. I feel like kids do that, though. Okay, I've got scraps stuck to this. Oh, well, they'll come off. What do we care? Where's Peta? Peta is at home. Steph, he, well, he was here this week, but I wouldn't let him come over because my child's high school, and then even better, my child's actual class uh, has a confirmed COVID case in his they're actually in his science class and his LAC class. Woo, woo. Okay. Um, I was dancing with my granddaughter. Oh, I love it. Okay. I need to find my, where are you? Mm -hmm. Who shall we do? I think I'm going to do you. There we go. Okay. We're going to need to chop some of this off because we don't need to put this much in. Yeah. Chop you. Feed you in. Okay, now I'm going to go to the back because I'm going to, well, actually, I'm going to turn over so I can see my writing. That way I'll know if I cut my letters off because we don't want to do that. I'm going to come back here and I'm going to. So it is, it's one of my baby's birthdays this weekend. And he is actually, this is really embarrassing, he's quite giddy that on stage is virtual because on stage has fallen on his birthday several times. Oh, did you just get it, Carla? Seriously? Okay, that makes me anxious. I just got a notification. Did anyone else get it? 270 match. Someone tell me. I feel like we might need to end the Facebook Live. Everybody run. Go check. We'll just, I'm going to finish the card super quick. You're replying to Lisa. Oh no, what was Lisa saying? I miss Lisa's. What was Lisa? Oh no, two youngest grandkids stay totally rocking it out. It was 16 when I started going, but I drank. <laughs> yeah, I was so, like, I, I mean, I think it, well, it, it was my epilepsy. My doctor told me that I couldn't drink with my, seizure medication but you can't just say so you no know, you can it just intensifies it just makes you really cheap drunk anyway I don't drink but I think it's because I just missed that window where one would acquire a taste for alcohol but I feel like alcohol might help us get through this time <laughs> look at it she's like I know oh my gosh now I'm super anxious stop really I'm getting anxiety yeah Kathleen I'm getting anxiety too and I don't even live there I don't know how you guys are coping right now okay we're going to smile and pretend and we're going to wish for peace to you and yours. Uh, Debbie, they need 270 is the majority. You need to be declared president there. It's that number of seats or something. Oh, your husband has epilepsy. Yeah, it's kind of the fun. I don't know. My son's got it too, Natasha. I couldn't just pass on brown eyes. I had to give him that. 
Let's be sweet, caring mother. Oh, you guys, this is actually turning out really sweet. I kind of love it. Okay, now I am going to throw in, I get it, really. You, oh no, you get it? Alcohol does help. <laughs> we are coping, we're dealing. I know. Uh, well, honey, I, I absolutely hear you there. I don't know how any of us, yeah, this, the world is, it's, it's a very different place. Okay, so what I'm going to do right now is I'm going to grab one thing. I am going to grab... And this is our brass foil sheet. And I'm grabbing brass because there was brass in this set. Okay, so we're gonna steal that. And then, just one second, I'm stealing one die. This is the die from the poinsettia one. Just a second and I'll show you why. Give me a sec, I don't wanna bring everything in because I have to clean everything up there then and I'm still die cutting things for team meeting packages. Hang on, it's coming. Five, four, three. Oh my God, can't move that fast, two. Pop out of the paper. One. Got it. There we go. Okay. There we go. Um, CNN chose 253. It's the number of electoral voted. I live here, so I'm still over this election. <laughs> I know. Our okay, so Natasha, it's not hereditary, so don't panic. Are you having children, I'm assuming, is why you're worrying about it. So, <laughs> I don't know, do you have really good lottery odds? I should. So, for regular population, when you get pregnant, there is a 4% chance that your child would have epilepsy. So, you know, like, I don't know, I don't know. That doesn't seem very large to me. It's fine. It's manageable. When you're an epileptic and you have a child, your chances increase to a whopping 6%. So no, it's not a massive increase. I just, the McKay family should really play the odds and go buy lottery tickets. So no, don't panic. Oh, I went off the wall with all the stuff you had. Super happy. Oh, good. Okay, so now I'm going to take this and I'm going to tuck this little dude right under there. I'm going to put you down. Hey, grab it onto bits. There we go. You're looking at me. Sorry. There we go. Oh, Carla, do not be sorry, love. Seriously. There, we just tucked that little one in. So peace to you and yours. Now, because I did find out that champagne rhinestones look killer. With this, we're gonna jump in. We're gonna find some champagne rhinestones and we're going to zhuzh this bad boy up and then everyone's gonna go check the news. Okay. Hey, my peeps everywhere, no matter where you are, we love you all and you're going to take care of each other and just, yeah. I don't know. That's all we can do right now, you guys. Everyone just needs to take care of each other. This world is a weird place right now. Okay, I'm going to do one more. One more. Okay. And there we are. Well, we have those types of odds. I also have a strange brain. I know, seriously. There you go, my dears. And so thank you on stage today for the lovely layout inspiration. And we just zhuzhed it up a little and and added some of our bits and away you go with your paper pumpkin. I did cut my card base down to kind of a more regular size. Um, anyway, okay, I'm still not. Everyone's there, good, okay, I'm coming back to you. Listen, no matter what happens, mwah, um, we're gonna do a Facebook Live tomorrow and we're gonna do a Facebook Live because it doesn't seem like it, no matter where we are in the world, it's going to be, it's gonna be an interesting next few days. And so tomorrow I'm checking my Stampin' Up! schedule. I finish at 2.30, okay? I will see you at 4 p.m. Pacific Standard Time and we will do a card together tomorrow. And I will use all new products and we're gonna do something fun and we are going to, even if it's only for a half hour tomorrow, we're gonna to escape and we're going to pretend that the world around us isn't happening for a half hour and we'll play. So 4 p.m. Pacific Standard Time. Corey, can you write that down and set an alarm, please? Because you know me. Um, and there you go, okay? And Corey, thank you for my encouragement to get on. Mwah, mwah, you guys. Have a great evening. Please take care of yourselves. Okay, night.